okay good evening to all today we are going to discuss about how to use microsoft excel for ogive power or how can we draw the ogive power using the microsoft excel okay so for this this is the continuous data from which we are going to construct the ogive power so uh, first of all you have to find out lower control bound as well as lower control bound u c b upper control bound okay so lower control bound of this data is 20 you can write down here okay 30 as well as 40 60 and 70 likewise for upper control limit you have 30 you have 40 you have 50 60 70 and 80 okay then you have to find less than c of okay to find the less than c of is equal to okay uh, this value is same less than 30 is same so for the next one is this value plus this value okay enter and drag it okay likewise for more than c of more than c of what you can do is the last frequency is as it is okay then for the preceding frequency you have to go uh, this plus you can go this this mm, plus this okay then drag it so these are the more than any latency of select all okay more latency of more than c of lower control bound upper control bound okay this is the line just then after after selecting the data you have to go to the insert and go to the this line so this is the ogive power but here are only setting you have to remove this one okay so this line for lower control bound no need to require so click here and delete likewise for this line for lucv also you can select and delete this is your ogive curve and here the x axis this limit it is different so for this right click and go to the select data then go to the edit then select this ucv value okay then write down the name okay the name of this figure is ogive curve okay and using the ogive curve you can easily find the median so for this go to the insert again go to shape line then from this line draw a line over here okay straight line we go to the that then after go to the shape weight then increase that one so this is your ogive curve thank you